it's very hard for someone who has an idea to say, hey, my idea sucks. Maybe what I built is a feature and not a full product. Sometimes you have to look at the numbers and metrics and really figure out, is this working? And if maybe we're just tracking the wrong things. There's a weird balance between like being opportunistic or when you see like people yeah. who have traction or like some, someone who's interested as a buyer, like who can provide revenue. And then there's also like the little bit of judgment piece of like, are we looking at the numbers? Does this just make sense as well? Like a lot of that is, comes down to like, are the founders thinking about this in the right way? I don't think there's really true IP unless you're doing like some really low level algo and like something out of the ballpark. I feel like everything else is more or less buildable. Yeah. And in today's world, it's more execution than idea. I think the naivety is very important, especially when you know you want to make it right. Because with the amount of like knowledge and information available today, I think it's very easy for someone to find a reason not to do something. Yeah. I could tell you a hundred reasons why this idea is not going to work, either because of TAM or Pro to whatever. But you got to have a little bit of that. I'm going to find a way to make it work. Yeah. Right? Or else it just never goes through. If you have the confidence to like, oh, this is a million dollar business, do it, but do it as fast as you can. Can you do it in three months? Like, cause if you can, that's sick. It's a different way to play the game as opposed to like having the game be like a large amount of money in a determined amount of time. See if you can make that smaller amount of money in a finite amount of time.